What's going on, YouTube? This is Super Dale. And today I got another video for you. Now, I received an interesting message on one of my past videos. A young lady said, Hey, Super Dale, I lost my Walmart on Streaming Box remote control. I can't find it. I need access to my box. Now, there are a couple things that you can do. Of course, you can get an OTG cable from Amazon. You can go to Walmart and even get one and connect it as long as you have a wireless mouse or a wireless keyboard with a touchpad you will be fine but just in case money is you know you don't have the funds to go and get that there's another way there's an application inside the google play store that you can use now let me share my screen right quick let me bring this up this is the application right here so if you go into the google play store I'm not familiar with the, the iPhone, the App Store. I'm only strictly talking Google Play. If you go inside here and if you have a, your phone or a tablet, you can actually use this Android tablet. All right. All this is based off of Android. All right. I cannot tell you about anything on Apple side. All right. But the, the company is called Census Tech. All right. So what you would do, you'll go into the Google Play Store. And you would type in like Android TV remote control. That's all you have to do. And then this should come up remote control for Android TV. And it means Android TV operating um, system devices. So this includes the NVIDIA Shield, the TiVo Stream 4K, the Mi Box. This includes the Walmart on boxes, the Verizon um, streaming box, the, some Mi Cool devices. Also, guys, if you follow me a couple years ago, the JBL link bar, the link bar that came with Android TV operating system built inside. So this is it. So if you're on your phone or tablet, you will install this right here. Again, this is from Census Tech LLC. All right. So let me remove this and let me change a couple angles right here. Right now, I have my NVIDIA Shield um, set up right here. Here's the remote control. As you see, I'm moving the remote control. But what if I misplace this bad boy? All right. I'm going to grab my phone. All right. Let me unlock it. And then I'm going to go into the Play Store. All right. I'm going to type in Android TV remote, as you see right here. And so you will get something like this. All right. Something just like that. This is how it will look on your end. Let me just change this angle right quick so you can see it. It should look like this. All right. That's how it should look. All right. Let me switch back right quick. I'm going to install this bad boy. Give it about a good 30 seconds or so. Again, here's the remote control. I'm going to put that bad boy right there. I'm as soon as you open it. So as soon as you click open, it's going to search all the devices that is running Android TV operating system. Again, any, any device or television that's connected to your home network, meaning your, your home internet, it will find those devices that, that are running Android TV operating system. Again, NVIDIA Shield, TiVo, me box, the Walmart streaming devices, JBL, anything, me cool, anything that's running Android TV OS. You find the one that that belongs to you that you need to connect. So right now I have my, my NVIDIA Shield and watch what happens when I choose it. It gives me a code. That's the code I need to enter to pair this application to the NVIDIA Shield. So I'm going to type in 9E. And what's that 9E? And then when I'm when I'm done putting in the code, just hit OK. And you'll get something like this. And I'm a, I'm a, <laughs> you're gonna get something like this. All right. This is it right here. All right. Now, this is the free version. It comes with heavy ads, guys. It, it, I mean, you're gonna get very, very upset with the ads. So they want you to spend $5 if you want to remove the ads. I don't think you need to. Just close the ads out and keep going from there. 
So from here, I'm using my phone. And look at that. I'm actually moving. And again, as I showed you, here's the ad right here. All right. And so we're going to close that out. Go back to it. We can go back. We can go up. We can go down. Now, I'm in the remote control feature. At the bottom of this, you got the number pad. Here's the number pad. All right. Uh, hopefully it blends in. That's the number pad right there. All right. So let me switch that back on over. One thing about the number pad, if you look at the top, it does have a mouse. All right. And so with the mouse, you can just you can just slide over. Now I don't have like the mouse toggle, but it will let you go up and down if you don't want to click it. And then you got the back button and you can just go back. So if I want to go in into Nova Video Player, that's all I have to do is just tap it. And then I can go up. And again, another ad. <laughs> so it is ad driven. You just hit close. And if you want to go down, you can. All right. You can just go over and this snap. If you want to get out of here, you can hit the home button and you can go right there, guys. It's as simple as that. Um, it does have like some play options. So let me just see this. I'm going to go back into here and let me just see something. All right. Let me just click on Str Stranger Things. I'm going to hit the play button and there it is. It's going to play, but I'm going to stop it. All right. I'm going to stop it and back out of it because I don't want to play. So everything seems to be working on here. And also, of course, the if you want to use the keyboard, they want to charge you, all right? But let's see if the mouse, um, let's see if the, the voice control work, because it does give you this option right here as well. So you see it has the microphone at the top. I'm going to speak into the microphone. Let's see. Oh, well, that's for the premium version as well, all right? So... In order to unlock the keyboard and, you know, the, the voice command where you can talk into it, you will have to get the premium. But I don't think you need it. You just, you know, it is what it is. All right. But that is one way you can actually get it going. I think this device is very, very nice. This Well, not the device, but the app is pretty, pretty nice. And it will get you going. All right. It will get you going. If you like this video, guys, thumbs it up. Also share it inside your groups. That way it will help someone. All right. So if anything, batteries die, the dog done got the, the remote chewed it up, you or you just misplaced it. At least you have a backup. All right. And this is your backup right here. Again, right there. Um, again, let me know if you have another solution for anyone that will lose their remote to an android tv operating device let me know in the comments and we'll go from there guys i appreciate the love salute to y'all this is super dale guys and i am signing out this joint y'all be safe talk to you later peace